God damn, I've spent at least 40 minutes looking for motherfucking parking. I'm like, yo, let me get home early, do a video for my peoples. They love me. They want to see more. I'm going to try to produce more. 40 minutes. Yo, New York City parking ain't nothing to be fucked with. Let me, let me inform you if you don't live here. Wow, I can't stand this shit. I need to de-stress, have myself a nice Sicilian slice with a little whiskey on the rocks with a splash of ginger ale to just calm my nerves and get, get the shit going. Because today, the review that I got, it's a special one. It's different. Or is it? I don't know. Roll my fucking music. Let's get this shit started. You sexy motherfucker. Blessed morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. It's your boy. C to the U to the B to the A. And today I got a video not using full bottles. It's actually decants. Well, one's a decant and one's, hmm, you'll find out. The fragrance that I'm going to review today is none other than the infamous Molecule 01. I got this decant from MaxAroma.com. Shout out to MaxAroma.com. Go check them out. If you haven't checked them out, they have dope prices on designer and niche. A lot of fucking sales. Good customer service. Give them a shot if you're looking for the cheapies. They got the plug. So they sent me this decant. Obviously, it's not in here. I'm just showing the packaging. This is how they send the decants. They use the regular, these little fucking uh, travel spray decans that you refill on the bottom so when you run out, just repump them shits. And they got the little logo and whatnot down there, boom. I read a little bit about Molecules 01. I know they got a Eccentric 01, they got a 02, 03, 04, 0500. They got all this bullshit. The main component in this that was kind of getting me really excited is the ISOE Super. Something that sounds fucking mathematical in a fragrance right off the back i'm interested i want to know what the fuck is iso e super right i looked it up iso e super essentially is like a synthetic woody vibe that's supposed to be fizzy on your skin but can also be interpreted depending on your ph levels and shit like that according to what the naysayers say i'm a fucking dropout you know i don't know half of that shit e equals mcw so i was very curious to try this shit out i was like send me the fucking decant let me smell this shit for myself so the first thing that I did was pop the top, sniff it. Very faint. I had to look at the bottle for a minute and I was like, yo, did these motherfuckers send me something? There's liquid in there, but I don't smell shit. Smelling it again, I smell a faint woody cedar vibe. Very cedar, but faint as fuck. So I go ahead and spray it on myself. As so. Damn, the sprayer was a month. Jesus, fucking coat the shit out of me. On this initial spray, I get kind of like a really synthetic alcohol wood scent. It smells like, to my nose, if you guys ever put together like Ikea furniture, if you guys ever put together Ikea furniture, those little pl You done? You done. Fucking garbage truck, you done. Those little wooden dowels that you use to put fucking furniture together, if they were cedar, if they were made of, I don't know why, it just reminds me of that cedar smell. It's nice. For me, it's not a wow factor. There's some people who live and die by these fucking fragrances. Like, oh my God, this is the end all, be all, baddest shit ever. For me, it's nice, but it's faint. At least on my skin, maybe on yours it's amazing, but on my skin it's fucking faint. So what I did was maybe I'm tripping. I sprayed it on myself again in front of my chick and I'm like, yo, ma, smell this shit. She's like, what the fuck am I smelling? I go, right here, smell, here. She's like, I'm smelling here. I don't smell shit. I was like, are you fucking tripping? Have you been dabbling in some narcotics? You can't smell that? She's like, no, I don't smell shit. Moms came to visit. I was like, yo, ma, what's good? She's like, what's popping? I said, I'm chilling. How are you? She's like, I'm living. You already know. I was like, good. Ma, smell this. She's like, what, you took a shower? I go, hi, you funny, shut up, smell. She's like, yo, I don't smell anything. I go, are you kidding me right now? And then wifey's chiming in the background, like, I told you, see this, she don't smell shit, and doing the clap. I don't know why y'all clap. What you clapping for? That don't get your point across any better. Mom's just like, yo, for real, I don't smell nothing. I sprayed it again in front of her, she's like, nah, I don't, it smells like water. This is some bullshit. Why, for the price tag that this is, is it so expensive that 
my wife, who I'm trying to get butt from on the regular basis, and if you're married, you know that's difficult, can smell something that costs 80 plus dollars. This is a problem. I, I have an issue with this. I smell it, faint, I smell it. Then I keep doing more homework, and then people's like, yo, you're supposed to layer it or whatever. I don't do layering. Let's just put it flat out. Let me tell you why I don't do layering. I don't layer because one, I don't want to waste fucking multiple juices on myself. Number two, how if, if I start layering and testing on top of strips, they're not going to smell the same on my skin. You know what I'm saying? So when I put them on my skin, if they smell like shit, what am I going to do? Wash my entire upper torso that I just wasted fucking, you know, two mils or three mils of two juices to smell like shit. That doesn't make sense to me. I don't like layering. Fuck layering. I want to smell the shit by itself. This by itself, it, it ain't doing nothing for me. It's not do, I, I'm not happy with it. Thank God I didn't buy a full bottle with it. It's faint, it's nice and woody, but there's a bunch of nice and fucking woody faint fragrances out there. Eh. I do have a viewer who sent me his own version. And here it is. Homebrew 01. I believe the homie's name is Narada. I'm sorry if I butchered your name, my dude. I'm, I'm horrible at pronunciation. If you watch my videos, you already know I suck. Uh, this shit right here, I sprayed this. It got the same vibe, but I smell it. I can smell this shit. It's nice. If you like the molecule, I'm not gonna, you know, my dude, you sent this shit to me. I like it. I don't love it. Why I don't love it? Because I don't love molecules or one either. It just, it's not breath fucking taking. Now. Let's keep it 100, and I'm not just boosting it because both of these dudes sent me the shit. This one smells better. I can actually smell it. My chick smelled it. My mom smelled it. They actually got it. This one is a little better. It has the same vibe. It's got a little citrusy twist to it. I like it. I think it's better than this one, in my personal opinion. But, then again, they're both, eh. They're not, they're not gonna get me ass anytime soon. Let's keep it 1000. If you're into molecules or one, Homies Joint Homebrew 01. I'm gonna try to find a link and put it below. You can Google it or find them in the Facebook fragrance forums. Homebrew 01 smells better than this. Well, I could smell it more than this, to be honest with you, in my personal opinion. You fucking snobs are gonna disagree with me all day and that's your personal preference. Fuck it. That's just my opinion, that's my take on these two. That's pretty much it for Molecules 01. I'm saddened and slightly disappointed because the purpose of me wearing a fragrance is to get attention from chicks that I cannot have sex with and get attention from my wife who I need to have sex with because I can't have sex with nobody else because there's like you know a clause in your marriage stick, whatever you already know what I'm talking about let me know what y'all think comment below most of y'all gonna be like oh you're an asshole you don't smell this or oh, whatever I am who cares is this a ball sprayer no Cause they ain't gonna smell shit, they're just gonna smell, you know, sweaty balls. That doesn't do it for me. No ball spraying for you guys. Come back next week, you already know what time it is, it's your boy. Smooches!